Welcome back to Fortunate Living. My name is Nadine. I'm a registered nurse that works and homeschools my children. This is what our life is looking like right now. We had a ruptured pipe, entire bedroom flooded. We have been out of our bedroom for over a month, but life must go on. Just like on the nursing unit, something goes bad, something happens in the world. We have to have business continuity. So even though this flood is here, I'm still showing you the day in the life of a working nursing homeschool mom. Even though we're dealing with contractors, we're sleeping in my 19 year old's bedroom. Thank God he's in college. This morning I started off by getting up and wanting to go to work out at the gym. So I'm just running up to our son's bedroom to let my husband know that I'm heading out to the gym. When I get to the top of the stairs, I see that Nate the Great's bedroom light is on. I'm not even going over there because he will definitely make me run even later than I'm already running for the gym. Big J. So I'm just resetting the alarm as I leave. As you guys know, my daughter has autism and sometimes she doesn't use the best judgment. You never know when she might just wake up and decide to head out to McDonald's <laughs> all by herself and she's not capable of that. So we are in the habit of when we're in the house, keeping our alarm system on just so it gives us a heads up in case she gets any bright ideas. My gym is exactly eight minutes from my house. It is never crowded. I've gone at all times of day and it's not expensive. You know, we have another membership at a gym where they actually have like a basketball court, but that's for when my husband goes, you know, with the boys. But this gym is under 20 bucks and here I am working out. I'm looking at this uh, sweating thing that I have wrapped around my tummy. It's just so bulky. I'm gonna have to look for something smoother. See, look at that. And it's making my stomach like turn into two stomachs. <laughs> this is not nice. What you doing? Doing your chores? Yeah, it's blinding me. I don't know, I guess because it's kind of dark in here. Mm -hmm. You were up when I left. I saw the light on. Mm -hmm. What were you doing? Uh, I wasn't sure. I was. I saw the light on, but I was already running late. I, all right, so he was in the midst of doing his chores. I'm so proud of him. I'm coming to see what I want to wear. I am working tonight. I'm orienting a new nurse tonight. Um, and I went to wash out this sweat band that you wear around your stomach and I mean it really do a, it did a good job there was it was dripping with sweat this is just the remnants of it but I'm gonna go ahead and wash it out um, hand wash it hang it up and it'll be ready for when I want to work out with it tomorrow I'm recording you again Okay. I'm so proud of you. You're up. I see your dishes are put away. No dishes over there. Mm -hmm. Oatmeal, toast. That's a whole lot of butter, sir. You get your yogurt? You got your yogurt out. Look at that. He has his yogurt. He has some supplements in his yogurt. His DHA for his brain. And his book that he's going to read. What number is this in the series, Nate? I think it's four. Number four. Okay. I'll post about that series in here. It's a really good series for middle schoolers. I right, enjoy. I'm gonna take Destiny her vitamins. Okay. We prefer to treat Destiny's autistic symptoms with vitamins and supplements. I just, I don't think there's enough information about long-term use of psych meds. Destiny? I just have your vitamins, that's it. Here, Mama. Got it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I completely finished getting dressed. Now I'm back downstairs. I'm going to take my vitamins. What are we at? We're at 842. We've gotten a lot done and it's not even 9 a.m. So these are my vitamins that I'm going to take. I have like a vitamin C packet, DHA to help my brain. Now these B vitamins, they are so good for you. But what I will tell you is take them don't take them if you're trying to go to sleep they give you a boost of energy and then over here i have everything i need to make the kids lunches like i said nathaniel's heading out to humanities for his class 
with a teacher and then Destiny will be home. Her American Sign Language class is canceled for today, but I'm still going to leave her a lunch at home. I decided to run up and just peek and show you guys what's going on in my house during the day. As homeschoolers, I don't have to be in charge of everything. Here's my husband in his office slash game room. He works from home most of the days. Destiny's in her room working on what she wants to work on. And then here's Nate. Hey, boops. Oh, let me see. What you want? Remember you asked me the other day about my video and you said, you said about, but mom, it's not, two hours a day I work that you do school mm -hmm. do you remember that conversation mm -hmm. and do you tell me what you remember I remember so you said that you work with me like two hours and then that's not just two hours and then I do the rest of the work myself oh I know how it came up mm -hmm. I had a hater yeah I hate Connor well she's entitled to her opinion And I said, oh, you didn't like what I said to her. Uh, no, you just said, I hope your dreams come true. Mm -hmm. You didn't like that. Mm -mm. You didn't. Why? Why didn't you like that? Because, Dash, because she was a hate comment. But she believes what she said, right? She mm -hmm. believes that you have to be in school all those hours. And then she talked about how she goes after school and studies with her friends. Mm -hmm. So I said, well that I used to think the same way. Mm -hmm. So I'm not, oh. I'm not going to be mean to her because she believes what she said. Right, well, I'm going to make lunch, finish making lunch. Okay. Bye right. people. Bye, bye. Mama. <laughs> okay. So the lunches are ready. I'm all ready to go. I'm just going to eat my lunch before we go. It's about 1130 here. We usually leave the house at 12. I am making my, one of my infamous mocktails. I always use some type of, drink packet with a natural sweetener and then I add a ginger ale to it. Um, I, I just love mocktails. I love my fancy glasses. I love my straws. So it's been a really productive morning. Everything is on track. The hum of the home is going well and I'm going to work tonight. You know, this is all in preparation of getting schooling done, getting time for me and then still going to be able to go to work tonight and continue my career. Nathaniel wanted to change his watch band on his Fitbit to a white band. Since he started middle school, he is all about fashion. Here we are taking a picture of his cool outfit and my outfit that I chose for today. He is so much fun. It takes us about 25, 30 minutes to get to his homeschool class. We go twice a week and it adds just enough variety to our homeschool week. We love it. What you reading? Show me history you were just telling me about Bloody Mary. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I'm focusing on the road. Okay, so tell me what you just said. Somebody should have been more like Queen Elizabeth. Why? Did Mary die, I'm assuming? Uh, I don't know yet. Oh, okay. But what, is she being too nice of a queen? Yes. She's being too peaceful. Sometimes you gotta stab the people. Stab the people or your enemies? The enemies. Who are her enemies? Her husband, the Catholic Lords, oh no, the Protestant Lords. Uh, the Protestant Lords that didn't accept her. And then... Why didn't they, they didn't accept her as queen? And the Protestants wanted a Protestant queen. Yes. Mm. While Nate the Great is in class, I usually go shopping or go to the library. Today I went to Bath and Body Works and got some supplies for my self-care goddess baths that I take after every shift. When we got home, I headed up to hang out with Destiny and finish up any last minute things I had to do for work tonight. Nate wanted to do his math lesson in my 19 year old's room. His room has been getting a lot of work. Me and my husband been sleeping there. So then Nate wanted to do his math lesson in there. 
My son is away at Howard. He's a sophomore. He's on the dean's list. So much for that person that said my kids aren't going to succeed with me homeschooling them directly for only two hours a day. All is going well. You can do it, fortunate one. You don't have to play by anybody else's rules. Do what works for your family. It is working wonderfully for us and for so many other homeschool families that I know. So you can do it. So this kind of winds down our evening. I'm going to be coming up to take my nap um, in the bedroom we're sleeping in. It has been stressful with the flood. It happened in the middle of the night. I try not to even think about it. Um, I thank God that it wasn't much worse because flooding can be. I know people that have been displaced from their homes. So thank God that we are still able to be in our home. But I do have to keep myself in a mindset and not go in my bedroom because um, it's a lot to deal with everything that happened with it. I'm just going to stay positive heading into work tonight. Right now, I know that my family is home, safe, happy. We had a beautiful day today together as a family. And now I still get to participate in the career that I love being a nurse. So I'm going to see my wonderful co-workers. I'm going to get to see this wonderful nurse that's new to our department that I've been orienting. She's actually going to come off of orientation pretty soon. She's she's a light to be around. I love it. Um, so I just want you to know you can make all of your dreams come true. You can have it all. You can do what's best for your family, best for your marriage, and best for the community as well, and best for yourself. Love you, fortunate ones. Bye.